He's not just sovereign. He is for you. Isn't that remarkable? I'm going to guess that Jim and Eileen probably were frustrated and complained about the fact that COVID caused their trip to be canceled, and yet God was in it before it ever happened. You see, his eye is on you. He understands your need. He knows when you cry out to him what's going on in your life. And here he orchestrated their lives to be in a place where when this happened, they could get help and then showed himself strong on their behalf in that recovery. God loves you. He knows you. He wants to walk right into the midst of your need and intervene. Today, we want to take some time to pray with you. And we want to encourage you with some other people's stories. It's not just Jim and Eileen. It's others. This is Amy. She lives in Texarkana, Texas. She lost a sense of taste and smell over a year ago. She was watching this program on March 1st this year. Before praying, Gordon, you encouraged viewers to get up and get some household oil for the purpose of anointing. You said that it was simply an act of exercising faith based on James 5, verses 14 and 15. So Amy got some oil, and she <laughs> prayed with Gordon for God to manifest healing. After the prayer, <laughs> Amy was thrilled to find she could taste, she could smell again. She also anointed her arm that she was having trouble with, and it was healed. Praise yeah, God. Yeah, faith is an act. God goes throughout the whole earth. The eyes of the Lord go throughout the whole earth. And he's looking to show himself strong. What is he looking for? For those whose hearts are loyal to him. When the friends of the paralyzed man open up a roof and lowered him down in front of Jesus, the Bible says, when he saw their faith. Isn't that amazing? God's looking for faith. And when he sees it, when he finds it, he shows himself strong. Here is Laura from Mesa, Arizona. Six years ago, she had TMJ. The doctor treated, everything was fine. But a year later, chewing a piece of candy, the clicking and all the pain came back. Well, she was watching the 700 Club this month, March 7th, when she heard Terry say, you're having trouble with your teeth, pain in your jaw. Just everything is messed up. Nothing seems to help, no medication that you've used. God is straightening that out. All of it is gone. Well, by faith, Laura received the word. The pain left immediately. Wouldn't it be wonderful for you right now, the pain to leave immediately? Let's do what these wonderful people have done. Let's show God your faith in an act of faith. Lay your hand on that area of the body that needs healing. Terry and I will agree with you. Now, the Bible says when two or more agree touching anything, it shall be done for them by my Father in heaven. These are the words of Jesus. So let's lean into that. Let's lean into his word and let's come to him in faith. You touch, will agree, and God will do all the rest. Pray with us. Lord God Almighty, we come to you and we come to you believing we come to you believing that you forgive all our iniquity. You cleanse us from everything we've ever done wrong. You make up for all our mistakes, all the times we miss the mark. You've covered them all. Now, you heal all our diseases. So we bring our pain to you. We bring our infirmity. We bring the doctor's report that tells us there's no hope. We bring it all to you. For with you, there's always hope. There's always healing. There's always restoration. Stretch forth your hand to do miracles. Miracles, signs, and wonders. For we ask it now in Jesus' name. There's someone you're suffering with heart failure. You saw that wonderful story and you're saying, could that be for me? It's like a great weight is pressing on your chest. It's, it's, it's just engulfing you. It's, it's hard for you to even breathe. God is healing your heart now. He's relieving everything that's blocked. He's giving your heart muscle new strength. He's even able to restore the wall of your heart muscle. In Jesus' name, be healed. 
Let new energy, new vitality come to you right now in Jesus' name. Terry? I don't even know what this is, but somebody, you have your ears burn. It's so strange. I don't know what's causing it. I don't know if that's a blood pressure issue, but they get very red and they burn on the outside. And it, God is just healing that for you right now. That and whatever the cause of that is, you're not going to experience it again. Someone else, you're having like digestion problems and it burns from your stomach all the way up into your esophagus. God's healing that for you. It's gone in Jesus' name. Uh, there's someone you've been um, out in the sun a great deal and you've developed lesions um, uh, and it's, it's skin cancer. You've already had the biopsy. God is healing you right now. In Jesus' name, you're being healed. And just so you know that you're being healed, you got this because you're a track coach and you were out in the sun for, for, for all of those afternoons. And, and God is just healing you. He's restoring your skin now. He's restoring the skin on the back of your neck and on your ears and on your forehead. He's restoring it all now in Jesus' name. Mm -hmm. Someone else, you're having problems with your right knee. There's a click in it um, and a catch, and God's able to restore. You're, you weren't even praying, uh, and you're kind of wondering, is that for me? And yes, it's for you. Do what you couldn't do before. Begin to move that knee and receive healing into that joint right now. Someone else, you're having an issue with swallowing. It makes eating very unpleasant and you really enjoy food. God's healing that for you right now. You're just going to find you can swallow without pain or discomfort or any choking of any kind in Jesus' name. Lord, we thank you. We thank you for all that you do for us, your sacrifice for us. You have become our salvation. We thank you for it. We bless you now in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. If you've been healed, let us know. Let us share your good report. 1-800-700-7000. And if you need prayer, we believe in prevailing prayer, the prayer that doesn't stop until you get the answer. So it's our privilege, our honor to pray with you. All you have to do is call us. 1-800-700-7000.